Okay, there has been a rumor that four of Mario's past 3D games will be getting a port to Switch, which is which is crazy. That this this shouldn't be getting me excited as much because let's be honest, rumors take them with a grain of salt. But the thing about this rumor is there has been leakers from credible sources saying this. Uh, many websites have reported on it. It just seems really likely at this point. So this comes from a website called Video Games Chronicle, and it says that Nintendo has big plans for Super Mario Bros. 35th anniversary. Before we get into that, let's talk about something about Video Games Chronicle. It is not that big of a website. It's just one of those kind of medium popularity, credible, like, you know, trusted websites. But there's also been news on Polygon, which is another great website that like a bunch of things are on there and is really trusted so we might want to we might want to look into this a little more so it says nintendo has big plans for super mario brothers 35th anniversary and it starts by, by saying nintendo is planning to celebrate super mario brothers 35th anniversary this year with several major releases new and old multiple sources have told vgc that the platform holder is planning to hold an event to coincide with this year's anniversary which marks 35 years since the start of the mainline Super Mario series in 1985. As part of its anniversary celebrations, Nintendo will reveal plans to re-release re most of Super Mario's 35-year back catalog of this year, remastered for Nintendo Switch, VGC was told. Okay, so, basically, Mario, this apparently, as it, let's keep reading actually, as VGC's network partner Eurogamer reported in a follow-up to our story, these remasters will include 1997's Super Mario 64, 2002's Super Mario Sunshine, and 2007's Super Mario Galaxy. Holy crap, I, I hope this is true. Super Mario Galaxy is my favorite game of all time, and if this happens, I'm going to flip and lose it. Oh my god. The other two, I can, yeah sure, everybody's been wanting a Sunshine remake. But I personally don't really like Sunshine, but Mario Galaxy, oh my god, that would be freaking amazing. I, you don't even know, like, let's keep reading. Okay, so it says, Nintendo will also release several other Mario titles in 2020, including a new installment in the Paper Mario series and a deluxe version of 2013 Super Mario 3D World. Okay, we knew there was a new game coming, and we pretty much already, like, determined that Super Mario 3D World will get a port to the Switch. But the new Mario game is actually a Paper Mario game, which... That's actually a really good call. Uh, Paper Mario is a good series, and I think the last game, Paper Mario game we got was either... What was it? Color Splash? Or was it Sticker Star? Oh god, if it was Sticker Star, then like, we need a new Paper Mario game, but Color Splash... Um, was that game bad? I'm pretty sure it was bad, but you know, whatever. So, the final thing we're going to look at here on the website, it says the plans are set to be revealed alongside new details of Nintendo's partnership with Universal and the pair's Super Nintendo World theme park attractions and animated Super Mario movie. Nintendo has already unveiled one flagship licensing deal planned to commemorate the anniversary, a special interactive LEGO Mario set, which sees players collecting coins and defeating enemies in real-life levels. Okay. We really need news on Nintendo's theme park, like, in Universal and the movie. We've pretty much heard nothing. We've had a little trailer for Super Nintendo World. That was about it. I mean, but the movie, oh my god, we knew, like, nothing about that. So, thank, let's hope that we'll get something like that. So, the last thing we want to look at here is it says the Super Mario 35th Anniversary reveal was originally due to take place as a physical event at E3 in June, BGC was told. But Nintendo is now reviewing its plans in light of the ongoing COVID-19 pandemic. E3 2020 has been cancelled due to the virus outbreak and Nintendo could instead opt for a digital showcase. So I can definitely see Nintendo planning to do something like this at E3. But at the same time, this fits perfectly for a Mario Direct. It literally, like what, five games? A movie? And a Mario, pretty much Mario theme park. It has Donkey Kong, but like, pretty much Mario. All at E3. That just seems like too much Mario. But a full-on Mario Nintendo Direct? That would make sense. Because it's Mario. <laughs> um, 
But with E3 2020 being cancelled, I mean, E3 is a big deal. Of course they would want to show it at E3 because a ton of people are watching, right? But having a little Mario Nintendo Direct is kind of... It's kind of not as big, you know? Um, but another thing that could I say that could have a Nintendo Direct in June is the fact that the ARMS character for Smash is getting revealed in June. And put that all in one Nintendo Direct when E3 was supposed to be. There you go. Which... It would be weird to have Mario stuff along with arms, but of course there'll be no more news and stuff, but like, yeah. Um, so let's talk about the games. So Super Mario 64, let's start out with that. Um, so uh, Super Mario 64 getting ported. That's great. I think this is not going to be a, a remake of the original Super Mario 64. This, it would make more sense to make a remake of the DS port. Because it had it's Super Mario 64, but it has more content. And that game really wasn't meant to be on the DS, considering the control scheme and just the data and everything like that, the graphics, you know. It should have been on the Wii. But put Super Mario 64 DS in HD on the Switch, that would be great. Super Mario Sunshine. People... People want that. People want an HD remaster of Sunshine, or a sequel, which I don't think a sequel is going to happen, but an HD remaster, people would love that. Me, personally, eh, I don't really care, but I know a ton of people would like that. So, Super Mario Galaxy. I don't think it really needs that much of a remaster. It just needs an HD port. Because um, the models and stuff in that game are okay for the Switch. But the main thing that's problem with Mario Galaxy are the controls. Sure, the motion controls will work just fine, but it's the fact that you have to point at the screen to collect star bits. How would they implement that on the Switch? Well, you might be thinking, well, they could point the Joy-Con at the screen using the gyro controls. While you can do that, we all know how the Joy-Con's gyro is. It isn't the same as the Wii. It's just not the same. The Wii makes more sense because you actually point at the TV. The Joy-Con, you can pretty much point wherever you want. And that would just be weird. And it probably won't be accurate. So I don't know about this one. But the thing about this whole thing. They're leaving out Super Mario Galaxy 2. Um, which I think could be kind of a collection with Mario Galaxy. They're both pretty small games. I'm pretty sure they could fit them on a cartridge. It would be kind of like a collection, if you will. Um, and let's scroll down a little bit. Uh, Paper Mario. We need a new Paper Mario game. Uh, that's all I'm going to say. <laughs> Super Mario 3D World, again, a lot of people have been speculating this. I already said all that crap about it. Yeah, this would be great if this was true. So with that being said, this, this is really exciting news if it is true. Which... I, I hope it's true, because I shouldn't be getting this excited over a rumor. I'm I'm gonna I'm not gonna be happy if it isn't, isn't true, but that's my fault for believing a rumor. So t always take rumors with a grain of salt. This could be fake. And well, if I go back here, let's see here. So, um, I know I know I know this seems real, uh, but we got things like Polygon, you know on this venture beat IGN too like literally like all these websites are um reporting on it so maybe it is real and if it is I will definitely make another video on it but until then thank you all so much for watching this video please do comment like and subscribe for more uploads and I will see you all later goodbye